George. The silver beetles, John. Tell George, the beetles for the lake. Hey? Tommy! Tommy, it's me, Paul. Come on, we got a gig. Yeah, come on, Tommy, don't let us down. Don't think he's in. Oh, he's in all right. The curtains are twitching. What the fuck's all our racket? Who are you lot? Uh, I'm Paul McCartney from the Beatles. I'd like to speak to Tommy, please. Well, you bleeding cat. <laughs> You're not going to let her talk to me like that, are you? Hey, hey, I'll tell me, Dad. Hey, can't you Tommy come out and play? No. It's finished with you lot. We have to eat, you know. Look, just stick your head in, love, and get Tommy for us, will you? Yeah, all right, mate. No, we're not all right. We're due on stage at the Grove in ten minutes now. Come on! Sorry, John. I'm out. What do you mean, out? I've gone back to the ball I need to earn a crust. Things will get better money-wise. I'm sorry, mate. It's more than my life's worth. you regret this, Tommy. I won't live to regret it if I change my mind. Oh, look at him. He's lost it. He can't shit without it. Oi! I heard that. Hello, John. How do you know it was me, Al? Because it's always you. What's up? Look, we're in big trouble. We need your help. You'll have some more trouble than you're worth. We've got this guy on drums. He's a fucking nutter. He thinks he's a beetle. Who thinks he's a beetle? And where's Tommy? He didn't show, so I... Asked the audience for a drummer. <sighs> yeah, something like that. His name's Ronnie and he's built like a brick shit house. I don't believe you, Lennon. Of all the stupid things to do. Look, Alan. This guy seems to think he's a permanent fixture. We need... That is, the lads need Tommy back. We're going to go around to his flat after the gig. We need you to meet us there. Try and talk some bloody sense into him. It's a matter of life and death. One more gig with this bloody animal and you might never see the Beatles again. Chance will be a fine thing. I'll be there as soon as I can. Yeah, cheers, Al. Come on, Tommy, lad. I want a word with you. It's no good, Al. He's not allowed out to play. John's right. He's probably got him in chains. Oh no, it's here again. Has anyone got any garlic in the crucifix? It's not, it's Tommy. Tommy, lad, what happened tonight? Look, I've already told her, lads. I'm out. Out? What do you mean, out? We've got bookings. I'm sorry, Alan. I'm not in any to live on. You're all good together. You're missing a chance of a lifetime. Yeah, come on, Tommy. You're a great drummer, isn't he, John? Yeah, uh, yeah, he is. Great. Sorry, lads. Sorry, Alan. It's no go. Oh, come on, leave him. He's lost his bottle. Okay, Tommy. Just one favour. What? We've got a gig at Lithland Town Hall. If I cancel, we'll never get another. <laughs> Will you play this one last time? Well, I don't know. Oh, come on, Tommy. You did leave us in the lurch tonight. OK, but just one last time. Good luck, Tommy. Eight o'clock Thursday night. See you there, OK? Yeah, see you well. Well, Johnny, looks like we're drummerless again. It's all right, Paul. I think you'll regret it more than us. Besides, you can play drums. And bass. And I can sing. Yeah, and you do that little dance. And play the piano. And play the piano. You know, I'll come to a conclusion, Paul. You know, big head is shite.
Well, Tommy, if your last gig is a pencil, are you sure we can't change your mind? Change his mind? He can't even change his socks without the dragon lady saying so. Hey, John, don't be like that. It's his last night. I thought we could stop in at the Grapes or the White Star on the way back into town. You know, for a farewell drink. Fair enough. Just to show that I know our feelings. When the van drops us off, you can buy me a pint. Oh, no. I didn't tell you that. The van. I got a message from Alan. The van's broke down. He says tonight we're all going to have to get our own way home. And he'll come back in the morning to pick the gear up. Oh, shit. That means we've got to wait for a bus back into town. Well, mate, I've got a mate coming to pick me up. Well, I'll settle then. We're all jumping with you. Just to show, uh, there are some of our feelings. You can fuck off! See you, lads! What's up with them, then? You know, I'll never bloody understand grown-ups. Don't believe him. Leaving us to catch a bloody bus. Anyway, at least one good thing came out of this. The manager said we can play at any time. That sounds quite promising. Yeah, it's just a pity this you don't. It's another size this record the can, or is this fucking boring? Hey! Beat us. You think you're out, don't you? You're fucking queers. There's only one thing I've got to say to that. Look it! Stu. One of the bastards done to you. Stu, can you hear me? I can't stop the bleeding, I'm going to take you to hospital. Oh, just take me home. Don't be deaf, lad. You might die, then what will I do? Oh, just take me to your mum's house. Fair enough. Come on, we'll get you home.